as with every winter, an onslaught of new restaurants have opened in the French capital, making it even harder to choose where to eat in Paris. So, to help you along, we've done the research for you by testing 20 of the most talked about places in the city, in hope of making the process of picking a restaurant to eat in Paris on your next visit as smooth as possible. From design forward hotspots serving up laid back cuisine to the young chefs en route for the stars, we've got you covered. Tucked out of sight just around the corner from the Louvre, the young crew at Granite are sure to nab themselves a few stars in the coming years for the stellar service, slick decor and magnificently crafted cuisine. Helmed by 28-year-old Tom Meyer, the young chef is no stranger to multi-Michelin star excellence. Having created no less than an astounding 400 dishes for three-star chef and Sophie Pick, Meyer's finally got his own stage to shine on. Handpicked by restaurant magnate Stéphane Manigold to revive this vacant spot that housed American chef Daniel Spring's first baby in Paris, Meyer leads a pack of immaculately dressed young promising talents in the kitchen and three end style hosting guests. A glass-fronted restaurant of 34 spots, Granite, not to be confused with the posh Chinese restaurant in the south of the city, is lined with open-grain sculptural wood panels that swerve along the walls, while deep sea blue Danish mid-century style chairs are arranged around stone tables, the Rama. Downstairs, guests dine under vaulted stone ceiling with the chef Patissier greeting them as they are shown the way by the personable Julian, Marie-Lou or Estefania. Meyer's dishes take diners from land to sea, open fields to lunar landscapes and back again. It's hard to convey the depth complexity of the chef's cooking without naming, almost, all the ingredients used. Even the hors d'oeuvres are worth taking time over like the shiso leaf cooked tempura style adorned with a film of beef consomme, or the bite-sized anchovy and eggplant olive oil tart, followed by a breaded escargot with squid ink. Crunchy and meaty, the play on textures of every appetizer is a real explosion of flavors. Starters of mussels with sweet yellow kiwi on a bed of verbena-infused burrata and a mushroom crumble with subtle curry-flavored brioche followed. The starters were followed by two mains, one of perfectly soft barbecued scallops from the Bay de Seine with kohlrabi cabbage, apple juice squeezed from the fruit skin and cone banh zest. The second main was a game dish of roasted Wakan pigeon with millet and fermented kabos fruit painted with a lick of meat sauce and served with pureed broccoli and coriander curry, 